Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Jin Zhe from the Department of Information and Communication uh, Engineering. I'm from the University of Tokyo. Today, I'm ha really happy to share my research with, with you. And however, instead of uh, giving you a, a really serious presentation, I'm going to uh, tell you about a story. A story about a dog. But before I go to start my story, I want to ask you whether you can raise your hand if you have a dog. Whoa. But uh, at least I think all of you like the all, at least I, animals. But uh, I'm sorry that today I'm going to keep a really a little bit sad story. <laughs> so, the story's name is uh, When Ibu Starts to Use Dogcubit.com.dog. So, here he is our main character. So, but um, before, yeah, here is our main character. His name is Ibu, and he's a male dog, and he has no strength, and he is old, like Otaku, a little bit like Otaku. <laughs> and the most important problem is that he is now single, so he's actually actively searching a girlfriend. So, so he goes to this dog, Cupid, dog, 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 dog. So, but uh, before continuing, I would like to know whether you heard about this uh, Japan, Cupid.com. Any of you heard of it? Oh, I'm so glad. Uh, yeah, I think you're not what happened. I'm really happy to <laughs> Yeah, JapanCubit.com is, is actually a site where you can find um, uh, the, the single girl or single uh, man that uh, when, if you are single. So this is actually not for you. <laughs> so, but Ibu actually he need this, uh, this site. And when he browse this site, he find a lot of uh, gross pictures. Of course, it's the female dogs. And he liked the picture really well because of this, the, girl, the, the female dogs there are really beautiful. And he also wants to open an account and upload his photo. Yeah, just as uh, most of the people do, they use uh, the, the camera, the digital camera or the um, iPhone to take their photos and then send it to, the, to this uh, such kind of website. And, but, uh, finally, he found that there are a lot of beautiful dogs which has already had an account there and their photos look really strong and really beautiful. What can he do? He, he, look, he he's, has a lot of uh, wrinkle and he's old. Okay, it's melancholy. So what can we help him? So he started to find some solution. And in our human world, we have the, some um, image processing technique which can transform our face to remove the spots on our face and make our face beautiful. So, uh, Ribu Ibu thinks that maybe he can also use simple technique <laughs> to remove the makeup and then trans transform it into a beautiful dog that, so that he can attract the female dog. But, uh, so, uh, to do this, could you please tell me what, what kind of uh, software do you use? Yeah, of course. Yeah, all of you know it's smart. <laughs> yeah, of course. Um, he goes such a lot of things and he finds this Photoshop software which is used by human beings also. And he tried to use this, this software, but unfortunately it's only for humans. So uh, he tried to use the photo filter, but what he can do is such a mm, the link is still there. <laughs> You just uh, use some <laughs> uh, and it just, just make him look, look, doesn't like, look like a dog. Oh, and after a lot of tries, the finally he can, what he can do is just like this. So it's absolutely not enough to attract the female dogs. So he continue, continue to use the google.com.dog and yahoo.com.dog and find, oh, it's actually a problem of structure texture separation. So let's go, let's go, let's go to look how it works. So this is a problem to make uh, the structure here, the texture here, into uh, uh, another image which is smooth and which is more beautiful, like this. And so, mm, and you continue to search, search, and find a lot of the related work in on the internet, and you find it that 
uh, there are actually a lot of humans are working on this field. So, but most of them have their own problems. So, for example, it causes uh, artifacts. Uh, it runs slowly, uh, or either it, it hangs some structure, but uh, it, it uses some complicated model. But the most important thing is that uh, Ibu lives in Japan, but they live in overseas. So Ibu walking, is walking around the street in Japan uh, to see how he can walk. And finally, he accounts a magician, and magician can probably help him because he can do everything. And then. Uh, he will make a, make a wish. He wants the method of uh, structure texture separation, which is uh, simple, which runs faster and effective. And the magician, of course, the magician can do everything, can give the solution. So, actually, the magician is me. <laughs> <laughs> this is a method, this method is produced by our lab. So, I'm going to become a magician. So actually, I'm the magician, not, not Muffin. Sorry. <laughs> magician. Yeah. Do I look him? Look like him? The magician? Yeah, of course. So, uh, so he would want, him, want the magician to teach him, but it's so difficult. But uh, it doesn't matter. Let's go to see it step by step. So, the magician is going to tell what is going to happen. So, first thing is to use the face congruence, which corresponds to our human eyes systems. And the, the structure and edge can be extracted according to the energy, lowest energy and highest energy in terms of the frequency. So, here we can see that the disc ground truth is uh, drawn by human being to, to distinguish which part is the structure. And the, our, our results can give a similar um, image. And then, so here we can see that it's actually the lowest uh, frequency and the highest frequency. So here is another example to show that phase congruence can actually reflect the, into, uh, the structure. And then, Ibus becomes more clear. Uh, but now, it's another difficult part which is called weightless square. But don't worry. The mathematician, instead of giving you the theory, he will give you a, a general image. So, uh, weightless square is a real mathematical model. It's so complicated. But if we don't consider the theory part, it will be only the to fit the data with a curve here. And then to in, uh, in uh, to keep the structure the most. So, if we include the phase congruence into the waste list square, uh, we can do a lot of things. And after several months of study, he will become a PhD student. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, we can do that right, right now, so we, don't, we are not going to do it. So, our results, he can run our method and give the good results uh, compared to the other method. And later, here and our method uh, running time is fast, faster than the others. So if we discover that our method can actually find a lot of, do a lot of things like to do the image abstraction and to do color forming and also to boost the uh, effects of the art articles. So look at this image. What does it look like? Yeah, of course, Sonic Mouse. And our method can actually translate this image into the Sonic Mouse. And if we see further, uh, those functions are provided by Photoshop. And if we include our method in this uh, function, we can actually see that we can do noise removal, uh, tone, uh, tone mapping, and image stylization, and also other kind of things also. So every story comes to an end for our story. So our story starts by when we start to use the dot, uh, cubic dot, 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 d
teacher started to learn structure, technical separation, and become a handsome computer graphics scientist and art. I'm sorry that I may not be able to do the program again, but uh, thank you very much, and it is a thank you from me.